Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. For today's video, I'm going to be doing a pamper routine. So it's been quite the week and I definitely need a good pamper routine, just a good mask, a good warm shower, stuff like that. So I'm gonna be taking you guys along with me. If you like me, if you like my channel, if you like my videos, please subscribe, give this video a thumbs up and leave a comment down below on what is one essential in your pamper routine. I apologize for my hair in advance in this video. I don't know what's going on with it today, but let's just get started. In case you're wondering, by the way, my robe is from H&M. I got out a while ago, so I'll try and have a similar one link below, but it's got like stars on it. Isn't that cute? I think it's cute. Also, like those are the products I'm gonna be using, but like my tripod, can we just talk about that? I think that's hysterical. So, I also apologize in advance for the yellowish lighting in this video. My bathroom just doesn't really have good lighting, but let's get into it. So I'm just going to remove my earrings. Um, I don't think I'm gonna wash my hair tonight just because I washed it last night and it looks fine. And I don't really like to take baths, I'm gonna be honest with you. I'm not really a bath person. We're just gonna take a really nice shower. But first, we're gonna remove my makeup. The makeup remover I'm just gonna be using is the Neutrogena cleansing tablets. Taking all that off, I love taking off my makeup. I literally just can't stand the feeling of like having a ton of makeup on my face. Also, that's disgusting. So as we can clearly see by just like how I'm looking, which is not so good. I, I don't know if you guys can see, or you obviously can, but I have the worst under eye bags right now. It's just, school is hard, man. But once my makeup is off, I feel like it's not really off. You know, obviously makeup remover doesn't do enough. Um, and we are going to wash our face but after we get out of the shower, before we get into the shower, I'm gonna be using one, one more thing to get my makeup off. This is the Simple Micellar Cleansing Water. Anyway, I'm just gonna be taking this and putting that all over my face to get the rest of the makeup off. Not sponsored, but get this stuff because that just took off so much more makeup than I thought I had left on my face. <laughs> Gross. Okay, so I'm gonna hop in the shower and then I'll be right back. I'm gonna be washing my face with the Origins Modern Friction Scrub, I guess, and then the Glossier Milky Jelly Cleanser. This duo rocks. So I'm gonna wash my face with that and then we're gonna do a mask. And I'm going to be filming the rest of this video in my bedroom because the lighting in my bathroom is seriously terrible and I'm so so sorry about that but anyway I'm going to wash my face with one more product before we get into doing like a mask and stuff like that so this is a charcoal soap bar this is by the brand herbivore I think it is I'll have it linked below just as I'll have all the other products linked below but I'm just going to be using this and what charcoal basically does is like clears literally everything out of your skin. I only use this probably a couple times a month. Like I don't use this that often, but I'm just going to be washing my face with this and then we're gonna get into the mask. So this is the mask I'm gonna be using tonight. This is the Gline Med Plus mask. I've honestly never heard of this. They don't sell it at Sephora or anything, um, but I get it actually from my Facialist. So I get my facials done at this salon called Mario Tricoshi. If you've ever heard of it, then you probably have one near you, so you can get this there. But I'll have it linked below directly from the company. Like I said, this isn't sponsored or anything, but this is a really good mask. I literally look like Fiona, like from Shrek. This mask is like top notch, you know what I mean? So. Um, you could really leave this on for however you like. The mask itself is very hydrating, so it's not gonna really tear at your skin. It's not gonna like strip your pores apart, you know what I mean? It's very hydrating, kind of repairing, I guess you could say, mask. So you can really leave this on for however you like. It's not gonna like irritate your skin. So I've actually decided to watch a movie tonight, so let's pick one out. I think I'm gonna watch Clueless tonight because this is one of my favorite movies so I have three products left and then I'm gonna watch this movie and just go to bed so the first one is this under eye cream this is the benefit it's potent under eye cream 
So as you can see, I have terrible under eye bags. So we're gonna put this on and I'm just gonna take a little bit of that on my ring finger and apply it. So next is my moisturizer. So this is the um, Philosophy Renewed Hope in a Jar Moisturizer. It's a very thick, I guess you could say, cream. Definitely very hydrating, so I'm just gonna take a little bit of that and I'm gonna put it on my face. And the last product I'm going to be using tonight is an oil. So this is the Milk Makeup Sunshine Oil. So you just kind of click it like a pen. And then I'm just gonna put that on like my cheeks because my skin gets very dry and this definitely helps it a lot. So that's it. I'm literally just gonna lie in bed and watch this movie. I'm gonna go to sleep super early tonight because I'm exhausted. Thank you guys so much for watching. Leave a like on this video and a comment on what's one essential in your pamper routine. And please subscribe. Bye. You know it's gonna be a good night when the Christmas lights are on.